With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So the students, in this question, we have to tell that this number A B C is given us to us in as sixteen positive numbers. Okay, and they are in AP. We have to check this condition and tell out of this which condition is true. Okay. So see, as these number are in AP. Okay, so I can write them with the help of my anastom of an AP. Okay, see here we usually write small d, but as small d is already present here, so I will be writing capital D. Okay, so let this number are having a common difference of capital D. Okay, so I can write my first term to be what? First term is A itself. Okay, second term which is B. Wait a minute. B is will be equal to A plus capital D. Second term will be A plus two D, and third term will be A plus three D. Okay. Now I can check this option. Okay. See if I consider my option one. Okay. If I consider this option one. Okay. So let's write its left hand side first. Okay. Which is given as in option one. Okay. A plus T. So this will be equal to what? If I write this with the help of this, okay, this will be a plus d is a plus three d, okay, with the help of general term of an AP, okay. So this will be equal to two a plus three d, okay. Now let's see the right hand side of this option, okay, which is given to us as what c. It is given as p plus c, okay, b plus c. So let me calculate this. B is a plus capital D. And C is a plus two d. Okay, so this will be equal to what C two a plus three d. Okay, now as you can see, my left hand side is coming to be equal to right hand side. So it means this relation satisfy this condition. So this option will be correct. Okay, so see this will be my answer. There is one more trick to solve this question. Okay, see then if we take Some numbers which are distinct positive numbers and and in our AP we can also solve this question. How? So let take this numbers as one, two, three, four simple numbers. Okay. See, these numbers are distinct positive numbers and are in AP. Okay. See, if I check this option through these values, okay, we can also come to our answer. Okay. So see, a plus d will be one plus d is four. B plus C, B is two, C plus is three. Okay, so C. It is giving me five. It is giving me five. Five is equal to five, so this will be true. Okay. Now let's check other option as well through this concept. Okay, C. A plus C, A is one, C is three, B is what? B is two, D is four. This is giving me four. This is giving me six. So this option is incorrect. This is giving me one. This is Four. Okay, two into b is two and c is three. Okay, so this will give me two plus three, five into two, ten, and this is giving me five. So this option will be incorrect. Again, this will give me one plus four, five, and this will give me three into two plus three, five into three, fifteen. So this option will be incorrect as well. Okay, so that way you can also solve such question. Hope you understand the solution. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.